Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming to you with another episode of Dragon Age Origins. Alrighty, when we left off, we had made our way fighting to here, and uh, I'd say we're doing pretty well for ourselves, considering uh, our inventory is a little fuller than I would like, but I don't want to have to go all the way back to Soldier's Peak just to get rid of the extra stuff quite yet. So we'll just slowly but surely drain off uh, the loot that we pick up. Also, I'm noticing that Liliana isn't using the ability she should be. So there we go. And everything else is Back doing okay. Again. Cool. Alrighty. And with that in mind, we go forward, but not too far forward, because I have a feeling there's going to be challenges around the corner, literally, as I say it. Okay, there's going to be a number of them. And I'm not running forward, because that's stupid, because I don't know what's around the corner. Nope. Nope. Come on. There we go. That's what I wanted. And now I'm stuck. And now I'm stuck. <laughs> okay, come on. And... There we go. <laughs> There's just Herlock standing there like, yeah, I'm getting myself hyped up for whatever fight's happening over there. Even though you didn't join it. Idiot. Okay. Uh, let's... Well, we've weaned off half of the forces, so whatever's around the corner looks to be a Herlock and a Genlock, but I'm assuming that Genlock is an emissary due to the fact that it has a shining thing on the back of it. I'm going to assume that that's a emissary, which means it'll be magic, and that means it's going to be a problem. So, I guess go for them first. Onward! And I'm stunned. And I'm stunned. <laughs> so much for that tactic. Oh, great! A sneaking spider to boot. Wahoo. Alright. Time to get you. Because... Fuck you, dude. You... Bastard! Are you for real? And I'm dead anyway. Yep, maybe not. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Backing up. Backing up now. The backing up is now. Oh boy. There's an ancient dark spawn? What? What is this? What is this? Okay, so you are running out of mana a lot faster than I would have expected. Okay. Oh, he hits hard. Okay, I keep accidentally switching when I don't mean to, and she's dead. That's not good. Oh, but I beheaded... I beheaded the ancient dark spawn. That's probably good. Eliana's in trouble. Alright. That would leave a scar. Last. That is a lot of gold. <laughs> that is a lot of gold that I didn't expect off of one enemy. And also Topsider's Blade. You have found all the pieces of the Topsider's sword. Returning it to his corpse may bring him some peace. Oh, yeah, that's right. I did see his grave in Orton Taig. That's right. That's right. Maybe I'll get something out of it. Who knows? Who knows? Uh, I'm going to pop one of those. And... Reapply that. There we go. You're good. You're good. And you're good. Okay, well, that fight didn't go exactly as I hoped, but better than I could have planned it? I think? Probably? 
Yeah, probably. So anyway, um, actually, now yes. I think about it, let's get you making some health poultices. That's a good idea. I need to get a lot more elf fruit, but I know where to buy it. So I don't have a problem with that. Concentrator agent. Well, it, it would require master herbalism first, so we'll worry about that later. But... Yeah, I know exactly where to get elf fruit. Exactly where. I was worried about not being able to get more. All of the stuff I had collected and whatnot. Turns out, I don't need to worry about it because I know exactly where to get it. Soul Rock Coating and Demonic Ecor. Okay, well, uh, let's toss some of that. There we go. That's good. Um, did I get anything that was good? Good-ish? No? Just the demonic ecor? And then the topsider stuff, but that will be later on my way out of here. There's apparently herlocks over there. Thanks for the spoiler game. <laughs> All right. But it makes sense, considering this. Although I'm not sure if this place will be trapped. That... I don't remember these markings being on the floor before. What? At least when I was looking over here, they weren't visible. Then I turned the camera and they're there. Okay, that's weird. Uh, hmm. I'm sure there's going to be traps, so maybe lead with Liliana? Yep. Haha. Oh, I see. Of course there were going to be shrieks. Why wouldn't there? Okay. Time for a health poultice. Not, not stun. Okay. Alright. Alright. I'm not going to let you move too much more than what you did. Oh, it's another Herlock. Hi there. If you actually did the things I asked, I wouldn't be on your back. Ooh. Beautiful. That's what I like to see. Alright, not too bad. Another acidic coating. We got some loot over here. A lot of loot. Jesus. Okay. Fluorospar. Okay, not too bad. Alright, not a lot of extra loot, though. Like the armor pieces for the Legion of the Dead. I'm not seeing a lot of that. Just kind of hoping there'd be some here. Oh well. Uh, let's deal with the other crap I don't need. Like the acid flask. And the acidic coating. There we go. Throw those into junk. That way I can easily sell them when I get back. Oh! Getting an autosave as I walk into the area. I'm not sure if that's a comment on my ability in this game. Or if it means that there's something really big bad going to happen over here. I'm going to lean towards the latter. While also keeping the former in mind. Okay. Okay. There is a little dark spawn camp over here with dark spawn effigies? At least that's what they look like. Interesting. Twisted creatures. Uh nope, don't don't walk any further than that. What are you doing? What are you doing, girls? Come on. Let's not do something crazy that will then invite death. Okay. And down they go. Okay. Not bad. Not bad. Could have gone worse. Of course there's more. Of course there's more. But it doesn't seem like they want to move. At least not yet. Oh, because they're all archers except for the emissary. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. 
Wait. Is that another... Okay, is that another... It is a Herlock Alpha. Okay, I was hoping it wasn't another Ancient Dark Spawn. Because <laughs> that would have been too much. Okay, resisted it, but it's fine. Okay, now you need to get healed. Ow! Ow! Okay. I'm gonna target you, just because you are being a pain in my ass. And I'm stunned. Uh-oh. And gonna make you have one, too. Forge Master. A forge Master, huh? Well, considering we have taken out the entirety of your buddies, we'll see how long you last. Forge Master. Oh. You have a hammer. Okay. Well, that's probably not good. Yep. Okay. Well. Okay. Oh, boy. Okay. Well, it's time to <laughs> give her some mana, because I'm dying without her healing. Ooh. Nice, Algren. Beautiful. Forge Master's Hammer and Spear Thrower. And a lot of money. I'm going to take that first. Uh, spear Thrower, Sylvan Wood. Is that better than what? Le yeah, it is. It is better. With rapid aim and armor penetration, but not an increase to attack. But she can still wield it. Higher range to boot. And even more armor penetration. Okay, well, I, I don't see why I shouldn't. All right. Forge Master's Hammer. Additional attack and 25% fire resistance. It is the same tier as his uh, Battle Axe. Less damage, but it hits... A lot more likely the critical chance is lower, but that's because it blows through armor. And the strength modifier is increased. Plus it has the capability to be enchanted. I think we found Ogren's new weapon. <laughs> I think that's what we found today. Alright, so we're going to give you that. And we're going to give you this... And let's check her other weapon. Oh, it's Falun Din. Okay, well, uh, <laughs> maybe we should be running that more. Uh, so, yeah, we'll make that her main. And then, yeah, no, that's good. That's good. I don't want to toss the wolf killer, but... It's kind of outclassed by everything else that she's running. So I guess I'll hold on to it to give to Zeverin, maybe? Maybe? Uh, unless we get more archers. Okay, that's entirely possible. All right. Now I guess we can finally toss this thing. All right, and the great sword might as well toss that too, because I don't think there's going to be anything better than that coming for a while. Okay, broken crate, fire arrows, that's not too bad. Frozen lightning, also not too bad. You need to re-enable your stuff. And I can't put on suppressing fire yet. Rapid shot was... No critical hits. Defense bonus. Okay, so it was suppressing fire that was good. Yeah, it was suppressing fire that was good. So I need to wait for her to be able to do that for now. Oh. Since I'm already going to be waiting. What's next? Darkspawn Mall. Okay, well, that was worthless. All right, fire arrow. Sure, why not? Let's throw it on here. I don't see why not. 
All right, and can she do it now? Yes, she can. Beautiful. And then... Come on, turn on aim. Uh. Don't you... Uh. Okay. You need to turn on uh. everything else. Don't you... Uh, either. Long day. Oh, come on. You're not going to let me turn that on yet? Yeah, screw it. While I'm waiting. Ooh, a health poultice. Nice. Beautiful. All right. And I am as good as of it's going to get. Perfect. All right. Now those are all turned on. Let's look around and loot. And not a lot. Not a lot going here. Other than what we already looted. From all the other bodies. Okay. Okay. Well, in that case, I'm going to assume that's the critical path. <laughs> yeah, it looks like it, because it's going through the bridge that we saw that isn't broken compared to the one that was. So, let's go this way. <laughs> loot the stuff here. And it looks like there's some things to loot. Short bow, meh. Ice arrow, meh. German hail rune. Okay. Not too shabby. Not too shabby. Okay, so, uh, nothing really worthwhile. We came out of there. <sighs> I was hoping for more of the Legion's stuff, but I guess that's not going to happen yet. Mm -hmm. Let's put the ice arrows on this one. I don't see why not. All right. And away we go. I don't see any difference between either side. But just in case. Yep, nope, nothing. Metal door, though. Well, hi there. Other hi there. Xbox One wanted to be part of the fun. And there's the part of the bridge we saw that was broken. There's the other half. Also broken, but this way no works just fine. Fine enough that we're getting attacked by Shrieks. Wahoo. Alright. Die already. Oh, we're getting attacked from all sides. That's not fun. And I'm stuck. Fantastic. Oh. Okay. Okay, good. Alright. If you actually did the things I asked. Okay. Okay. Alrighty. Alrighty then. Lesser health poultice. Good thing, because we need more healing items. Because I'm running low. Jesus. Alrighty. I can't turn on Berserk yet. Okay. That's fine. That's fine. I didn't expect that we'd be getting attacked on both sides. I figured it was just coming from the side I was facing. But it worked out. Worked out for the best. Considering. Alright, another one of these where I'm not sure if there's going to be anything worthwhile. Oh! On the Dwarves' Unknown Burden. And then Liliana gets a level up. Cool. All right. Um, ow. Cracking my knuckles accidentally on my feet. It's not what I intended to do. Okay. Um. Let's up cunning a bit. And then up dexterity further. I don't see why not. Um. Hmm. Trap making or tactics? I want to go with trap making. Honestly. Enemy traps detected at greater ranges. That is actually not bad at all. Okay. And now that I have gone up in dexterity, uh, hmm. Very long, very long. Okay. 
Archer generates an automatic critical hit if this shot finds its target, although high-level enemies may be able to ignore the effect. Huh, Archer, summer, oh, <laughs> Archer suffers, reduces stamina regeneration. Mark, okay, adds an extra bonus. Master Archer adds an extra bonus for arrow slang. Hmm. Archer fires a single arrow that automatically hits, stunning the target and dealing normal damage. The arrow then shatters, hitting all nearby enemies with the same effect. Well, why not? <laughs> well, why not? All right. Okay, well, with that in mind, let's adjust some of her tactics now. Well, how about that? Look at that. Clustered with at least... Two enemies. Eh, let's go with three. Then we... Activate mode. No, I want... I want to... Why won't... <laughs> That's not activating a mode. I want to use an attack type. Come on. <laughs> Why won't it let me do that? It's a usability. That's weird. Um, clustered with at least two. Well, it it won't it won't. I mean, I don't understand. I don't understand. It is weird, but whatever. Let's clear it. I guess. Um, enemy. Uh, maybe any. I guess use any. There we go. And then usability, I guess. Uh, pff, I don't know why it won't let me do scatter shot for clusters, but all right, whatever. Yeah, it just won't let me do it. Makes no sense. Target at range. Um, short, medium range, I guess. And then usability. Okay. Sure. Why not? Makes no sense why I can't do it for clustered, but whatever. Either way, doesn't matter. Now it's done. <laughs> and now I can move on. Another autosave. Okay. Well, the game is letting me know it's going to get real hard real quick. I'll get on it. So, let's <laughs> giggly. All right. Why can't the dead stay in the ground? Oh, so these are just now better than later. Undead. Okay. Well, good thing we're using fire. Okay, there we go. Ow. Ah, Herlock Emissary. That explains a little bit. But not enough to explain all of this. Oh, jeez. Okay. Okay. Ogren's going to die unless <laughs> you get some healing. Which I really... Should be focusing on giving her more. Okay, alright. Heal. Heal. Okay, never mind. Alright, well, getting some decent damage done. Ow. Alright. You are not going to keep attacking Liliana. You are going to die. And I'm assuming Ogren took out the emissary. Yeah, it looks like he did. Okay, good job. Good job, Ogren. Good job. Okay, let's use a lesser injury kit. And let's reestablish all your stuff. There we go. Great. 
Okay, you didn't put on threaten. There we go. Thank you. Okay. Now we loot. <laughs> Alright. Man, there's a whole lot of these. More skeletons than I thought were available. Lesser injury kit. Well, at least... Injury kit was a freebie. Sarcophagus. Armor of the Legion. There we go. I think that makes a whole set. Don't it? Don't it make a whole set? Also, yeah, now it's telling me about the quest. Okay, we've got the boots, the gloves, and the armor. Is there a headpiece? Apparently not. Okay. Okay. It's a bit above what I can do. But that's fine. That is fine by me. We will definitely be getting Ogren into that suit as soon as possible. Or something like it. Well. Looks like a piece of armor here. Like the grave of a paragon or something. At least I'm assuming that's the case. With how much memorabilia is sitting next to the grave that looks like it's also been broken open by the Dark Spawn, because the Dark Spawn have no concept of resting in peace. Nor really any concept of being decent people. Because they're evil gremlin things. <laughs> Technically. Okay, metal door is all we have. So there we go. Beautiful. Oh boy. I should probably make sure to turn that on. That. Yes, you can. You just did it. Come on. First day they come and catch everyone. I'm sorry, what? Lyrium dust, okay. First day they come and catch everyone. Okay. I'm not sure how to take that. Also, I'm a little overburdened with stuff. I can get rid of this at least. Um, hmm. First day they come and catch everyone. And I heard that pretty much out of thin air second day they beat us and eat some from meat um i'm assuming this is talking about the dark spawn okay then I'm sorry, what? Six day her screams we hear in our dreams. This is taking a goblin slayer turn, and I'm not sure I appreciate it. This is definitely taking a turn for Goblin Slayer. Hmm. Okay. Well, I'm now no longer sure which one's the critical path, considering that uh, the talking seems to be going while I'm 
running this way. I'm gonna go this way. Mainly so I don't have to keep hearing about Sometimes that. Be careful. And I'm stunned because of course I am. Alright. Come on, let me heal. Okay. Oh, of course you are. Screw it. And I am hurting. Okay. Okay. And I beheaded the Genlock. And now we're going to hopefully do that with this one. Bastards. Okay. Alright. Well, we managed to survive that one. Now is better than later. I can't open it, but she can. Darkspawn Greatsword. Worthless. How about this one? It's done. Again, worthless. Okay. Well. Um gonna get rid of that and that. And Okay. Alrighty. Well, that was a nice distraction from the other thing. Now we have to listen to more of it, I'm sure. Hooray! Of course. There we go. Ninth day she grins and devours her kin. Okay, this is also taking a different turn. A different turn than I was being led to believe. I'm able to loot a fleshy sack. I don't think that was worth it. Now she does feast as she's become the beast. Oh. Uh, okay. Alright. So I'm assuming I'm going to meet her soon. Come and catch everyone. Second day, they beat us and eat some from meat. Third day, the men are all not on again. Fourth day, we wait and fear for our fate. Fifth day, they return and it's another girl's turn. Sixth day, her screams we hear in our dreams. Seventh day, she grew as in her mouth they spew. Eighth day, we hate it as she is violated. Ninth day, she grins and devours her kin. Now she does feast as she's become the beast. First day... Th um... Oh. Hi. Uh... You okay? What is this? A human? Bland and unlikely. Feeding time brings only kin and clan. I am cruel to myself. You are a dream of strangers' faces and open doors. Aha. Uh -huh. Examine her closely. She appears to be suffering from a high fever. Her skin is pale and she is covered in dark blotches. First day they come and catch everyone. Is this dark spawn corruption? It looks different. Corruption. The men did that. Their wounds festered and their minds left. They are like dogs, marched ahead, the first to die. Not us, not me, not Laren. We are not cut. We are fed. Friends 
and flesh and blood and bile and and all I could do was wish Laren went first. I wished it upon her so that I would be spared, but I had to watch. I had to see the change. How do you endure that? How did Bronca endure? Are you from Bronca's house? Do, do not talk of Bronca, of what she did. Ancestors preserve us. Forgive me. I was her captain, and I didn't stop her. Her lover, and I could not turn her. Forgive her. But no, she cannot be forgiven. Not for what she did. Not for what she has become. What did she do, Hespeth? What did Branca do? I... I will not speak of her. What she did. Of what we have become. I will not turn. I will not become what I have seen. Not Laren. Not Branca. Uh... Anything to add, Ogryn? Anything to add about that? Hmm? Anything at all? This place makes my skin crawl. Yeah? Yeah, how about all that stuff we got told by her? Huh? How about all that? Did that make your skin crawl? Because it made mine? Okay. Alrighty. Well then. Alright. Hmm. Alrighty. Okay. She became obsessed. That is the word, but it is not strong enough. Blessed stone, there was nothing left in her but the anvil. Oh, hi there. Oh, there's two of them. Oh. Eat my entire ass. There's two of them. Okay. And down you go. Alright. Got you. And dead. As is she if she doesn't get healed. And Ogren's taking it down. Good. A lot of money out of these. Then a demonic ichor, which isn't as good. Load limit reached. What? Mass will have... <laughs> Fuck off, Bioware. Fuck off. <laughs> Fuck off. <laughs> a nod to a game. Uh... Fuck off. Mass will have an effect, he says, as long as it lifts us out, I figure. Should have specified within my lifetime. Gives us time to talk, he says. How's a dwarf get named Shep? <laughs> Fuck off, Bioware. Fuck off. God's damn. No, really, because blah, blah, blah. Axe answers, but I still hear him. Drip, ground, drip, ground. Worse than his talking. Think I'll drop out for some air. Load limit reach. Anonymous scratching recovered from a cage hoist. Eventually.
Okay. Well. Is this a door? Yes, it is an op. It's an ominous door, in fact. Okay. We tried to escape, but they found us. They took us all. Turned us. Okay. And this is a normal door. One that I can open. Okay. Uh, I thought it would have fallen into dust by now. Well, clearly not. Clearly have ghostly apparitions sitting around it. Okay. I am not sure. Legion of the Dead Relic. The Gang Shade. The stone has a will that surrounds and directs. She guides even when we are willfully blind to her influence. But she is not pure. The stone bears a corruption as old as balance. For the dwarves to prosper, the, gang, the Gangue, I'm assuming that's how it's supposed to be pronounced, the waste and unstable rock must be cut away. But like the stone, the Gangue also has an influence. Each of us must face this, must carve the worst of ourselves away. But the Legion of the Dead bears a unique responsibility. Only the fully adorned of the Legion can face the Gangue, can cut into the darkness that afflicts the raw stone. She encircles us, and we must protect her, here where darkness meets light. Legion of the Dead inscription, undated. Interesting. I'm assuming it has something to do with the Legionnaire Altar. Helm of the Legion and Legionnaire Key. Alright. The Dead Cast. Oh, so this was, this was being updated as I was picking up pieces. Dearest Gilly, I know things have been difficult since the censure of our house. I had hoped to bear the cost of my actions alone, but if I had a full understanding of consequences, I wouldn't have murdered above my caste in the first place. I did not abandon you lightly, but I knew of no other way to insulate you against my shame than by joining the Legion. It is a half-measure that has earned me no right to seek your comfort, but please... I beg you for one moment of foolish optimism. There is talk of a new soldier, a noble. The things I have heard, I will not curse them by voicing them aloud, but it may be a path to respectability for my kin, for you. If there remains any official line open to our name, can you verify he is real, that he is real, that House Ferald is in good stead? All right, had to take a drink. May this report find the proper eyes to affect future tactics. We found an enclave of the spawn. Possibly a breeding lair, but we could make no approach. There were far more spawn than anticipated, and I divided the squad to draw the main body of the horde away. I do not expect to survive, but I have made certain that most of my men will see another day. I am torn by this, as my petition will go unheard, and that may curse many more of the Legion than would die here. But I simply cannot abandon the, med I, the men I have looked in the eye and called brother. Perhaps they will not thank me for this, believing themselves already dead. But where there is life, there is hope. I will not be the last to see their worth. There. Oh. This was by the Lord who was sent down here. Casualty. Durius Ferald, lieutenant. Found dead with his squad. The corpse was left untouched, suggesting the dark spawn feared his spirit even in death. His ferocity defending his men was corroborated by survivors before they succumbed to corruption. 
It is rare for a soldier's actual death to exceed the honors given at his enlistment, but Farold was an odd one, an agitator. His eccentric promises were disruptive, and I fear his death may demoralize more of the Legion than actually heard his fantasies firsthand. He was committed to the stone with his insignia, as honorable a burial as we can manage, with the spawn at our heels. But officially, he has formed a second front. Better his foolish hopes are diluted by time than killed outright. Godspeed, Feral. Oh, you... You bastards. How dare. How dare. I was being respectful. <laughs> okay, well, so much for being respectful. Okay, well... This Legion spirit's gonna be a pain in my ass. I'm trying to kill Morrigan. And there we go. All right. Could have gone worse. It's annoying that. They decided to attack me after I was trying to be respectful, but here we are. Oh, well. Maybe it's because I took the helmet. Maybe. The men, they kill. They're merciful. And the women, they want. They want to touch, to mold, to change until you are filled with them. Okay, well, this is continuing down the Goblin Slayer path, and that is making me uncomfortable. So I'm going to end this episode for now, and probably detox from my mental thoughts um, from hearing all of this, because I'm just going to get more angry. <laughs> I'm probably just going to get more angry. So for now... Thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. Click the like button if you like this particular video. And share and comment so you can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together and I will see you all in the next episode. This has been the one and only Stray Cat playing games and slowly making my way through the dead trenches and starting to wonder if I should have. But um, it's getting pretty crazy down here. Uh, apparently Bronca's house did not meet a glorious end, uh, in her search for the anvil, and it might have been a fool's errand. But I guess we'll find that out in the next episode, or the one after that. Probably that one. For you!